Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Journey of Life. And I've been uh, doing a little bit of work, I just actually went to go pick up a couple of bottles of water here, and i got to get them on the fire and get that going. As you can tell, I'm thirsty. I have been doing a little bit of work. Uh, I was just over at the, the iron mine there, trying to get some iron. Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. And I think I got 12 clumps, so I'll give us like 60 nuggets, because I want to start making some tools, but before... I get lost, I gotta remember which way I'm actually going. Uh, before we start making some tools, we gotta start getting into uh, plank station, yes. The reason why I wanna get tools is I wanna start cleaning out this area and start making a room to start building stuff. And also, you know, the stone tools are absolute garbage. You know, you cut down like two trees with the axe and you gotta sharpen it again. Uh, but as you can see, I do have some iron going. I made a made a couple more molds I made, uh, what do I got down there, uh, the hatchet, the ingot we already made, and then I made the nail mold, which we'll need, and then the saw mold, and as you can see, I already made this saw, because we need that for the plank station, and I do have some iron going, okay, we'll go ahead and grab all that ore, uh, okay, oh, it's not going to let me do that, I gotta, actually, put the, let's get the water on the stove, so we can get this cooking while I am trying to figure out what I'm doing here, Okay, go to number five. Get that going. Yeah, I think that was something the developer had was uh, failed ignitions. Possibly, or I'm thinking of another game. Anyway, so now I can go ahead and pick all this stuff up. I don't know why it's not stacking on me. Alright, then I can get some more in here and then uh, I can get that hammering while I'm doing this. Uh, as far as I can tell, this thing can only hold five. I've tried getting more than five in here and it doesn't want to work. So, just do that. Yeah, see what I mean? It's not going in. So that is good. So, uh, yeah, for the plank station, I've tried repairing this thing too. It doesn't want to work. and I think I need the iron hammer for that, which means we'll have to make a iron hammer mold too. But before we get into that, we need to get to... Uh, the tool workbench, which is, allows us to make the tools. As you can see, we need the nails, but I didn't realize we needed the planks. So we got to make planks as well. So in order to make the planks, we need the woodworks. So then I have I made the saw. I got to put the handles on it. Need five ri five fiber rope, uh, one two meter log, and uh, ten one meter logs. Okay, uh, sounds fair enough. Uh, chest is still holding up surprisingly, and I was trying to see if there was a way to. Oh, that's clear. Yeah, if there was a way to actually turn the ingots in back into nuggets, but I didn't find any way to do that. How are we doing here? Okay. And I can place one on the ground. I just don't need it right now. I will drink, however. And just like that. And I noticed, too, that you can drink as much as you want. You can stop halfway, and you can stop if your thirst is at a certain level, if you want. But needless to say, I have to cut down some trees. I don't even know how many logs I have here. Uh, let's see here. I have one two meter. Yeah, let's actually put that here. In fact, let's be smart about this. Well, we're talking about me here, so nothing's ever smart. We'll put the, actually, no, 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 no. We'll put the big stuff on the on the smith. Or crushing table. Yes, that is the word. Because I got a hammer, anyways. Okay, and that's that. And while that is doing that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm gonna cut this in half. What's well, making the sound, I guess? Be nice if there's a progress bar to let you know how far you were cutting that. That's another one I want to do, too, is try to. Maybe we'll do that first, just in case progression sends us that way. Why are you not cutting? There you go. But maybe we'll make that smithing furnace again. Oh, come on, I'm not trying to harvest a tree. Uh, oh yeah, smelting furnace. What did we need for that again? Let's actually do this. Let me uh, put some stuff on the ground here. If it doesn't go flying off into orbit. 
And I really do like that hole where you can lay stuff down. So I needed 25, uh, 15 high density rocks. Now I should have some over here. Somewhere. I know I had a whole bunch of the mine and I left them there. There's one. I had four at the fire. So let me gather these up and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I should have enough. I thought, it th I thought these things stacked in four, but for some reason almost stacking in two. But anyways, uh, let's go back to stations. Smelting furnace. I need three more. I thought there was four on the ground here somewhere. There is. Uh, see if I can reach it. Come on. See if it's actually in range. It is. Okay, so I need clay and an air chamber. So we'll go ahead and get some more clay. And uh, let's actually get some inventory space here. Please see this on the ground. No, I should have enough clay for this. I was going to pick some up, but I didn't have the inventory space for it. Okay, there's four there. Another four there. Oh, there was the other rocks. So it was accessing the inventory. Yeah, because you can read the four that's in the chest there. That's it. That's good to know. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm going to make the air chamber. And then I need six more clay. And there's four. And there's eight. And now we can go ahead and make this smelting station. Smelting furnace. Now we can make the smelting furnace. Okay. Uh, it doesn't matter where you place it because we're going to be moving it or taking it apart. Oh, uh, I guess I should pick up some stones. I'm going to need them. I don't even have the inventory space for it. Of course. Okay, and then that. More stones. I like how it does the progression like that. It's a really good idea. Okay, build the smelting furnace. Interact with the smelting furnace. Okay. Uh, now, how does it... What does it mean by interact? Maybe put some wood in it. Let's try that. Uh, go ahead and grab some sticks for now. Shouldn't be burning these because this is going to be... Well, we'll see how the new axe does. Did that not go in? Oh, I think I have to light it. I think that's what they mean. Maybe not. I'm interacting with it. What's going on here? Okay, that's just a tool tip about this. I know we can upgrade it. But it's not registering the whole, you know, interaction. Technically, that's interacting with it. But it wants me to smelt five iron. Do I have any iron left? I don't think I do. It's in here. I do, actually. The fire went out. <laughs> it's a good mistake. Okay, so what I'll do then is I will four more in here and now I can so obviously five is the limit because it's saying that I smelt five iron all right so I gotta get more word in there it's getting dark so uh, let me get the rest of this stuff together and I'll bring you back in the morning okay I have everything done uh, I got the logs here logs on me I just made the fibers as you can see so I should be able to actually make this uh, uh, woodworks where is it all the way at the bottom uh, water collector might be an interesting good one to get into too. There we go, it would work. Oh, I need the saw. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, it is as soon as I find those small sticks. And some inventory space. Uh, ooh. I need the hammer. I guess I'll, uh, I'll just remember the clays on the ground there. Or the iron. Uh, sticks, I had some here. No, I didn't. Not there. 
down there. But somewhere on the ground here is going to be sticks. There we go. Okay. Let's go over here. I got to drop a log off. Get some inventory space here. Go in here. Tools. Make a saw. I'll make one of those. Now I can go to the woodworks, which is going to be all the way at the bottom. Oh, there we go. Now, do I have to be in range? Because I want to put this up here if I can. There's a good spot for it. That doesn't really matter. We can move it afterwards. All right. Now to get the yield hammer out and hammer away. I like the whole silhouette thing where it shows you as you're building like it's more or less progression. It'd be nice if it was part for part, but yeah, it's not too bad. Uh, the the, bi the actual building, building the game is the same way too. And we'll be getting into that probably in the next episode. Uh, also, another one too, I didn't realize, and I actually forgot that it was there. Uh, where is it? It's actually in stations? Yeah. Can I actually build this? Oh, that's actually expensive. Well, not really expensive, but it's a lot of work. I was thinking about it. Like, oh yeah, we got the the mine the mine there. We can get the elevator going down in that big opening. But yeah, or a few planks away from that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I don't think so. Get out of here! You're in my house. Stuck, haha. Let's see if we can actually take care of him. And we did. What am I harvesting? I don't know. Oh, I'm harvesting the bush. Let's get the bush out of the way first. Let's see if there's anything we can actually do with the boar. That's another bush. Oh, we're getting meat. I'm not complaining. It's not showing on the ground, no. Hey. You all saw it. He started it first. Oh. Oh, lard. I might need that. I don't, we're also going to do a test here about, like, spoilage. So, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to turn this off. Because it doesn't need to be on right now. Oh, get out of there. And still haven't completed the quest. But yeah, I want to see if the food actually spoils. If it does, if that does spoil, it doesn't matter. Because, hey, there's crabs everywhere. So I've been eating for the past, well, been eating coconuts to be honest. But anyways, let's go back to this. Another reason to make a better axe. Probably does more damage. And there we go. Woodworking station. Cool. Alright, yeah, that's interesting. Alright, let's uh, see what we need here for the tools station. And then over here quickly. Uh, stations. Uh, it's also why I went and grabbed the iron, because I want to make a whole bunch of tools today. Uh, tool workbench. Need 10 2 meter planks. Well, let's see. Good thing I cut all these trees down. There's one, there's two, there's three. And that's it for down here. There'll be a whole bunch up here. Okay, now do these stack? That's the question. And we'll try this. I'm sorry, what? Oh. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah, 
because I know there's a log storage too that we can do. And where are the planks going? Oh, they're in my inventory. And they stack. That's great. Alright, so I need to get uh, some more planks. Uh, let's see here. Where are the trees that I cut down? There's a few of them. But anyways, I'm going to do this off camera and I will return. Okay, I'm working on the last two right now. And interesting enough, you walk away from the station and it keeps on crafting when you're not there. I was uh, cutting down the tree. See there? I was cutting down the other tree while uh, I was waiting for it. So that, that's pretty cool. So you can uh, get the log storage right next to it and get a whole bunch of logs in there and just get crafting planks for days and days and days. Okay, so the next one we got to make now is the tool. Uh, tool workshop. Yeah, I realized I made it went the wrong way. That's fine. Now, let's check our meat here. Okay, it's not showing anything. That is good. So we're going here and we'll make... Uh, we are making a tool workbench. Which is here. And I need to make the nails. So let us see if this is actually going to work now. Interactive smelting furnace. Smelt 5 iron. Don't get it. Don't know why it's not working. Mm, buggy quests. Oh well, that's fine. I actually need the uh, iron anyways, because we gotta make some nuggets. Uh, do that. Actually, I had more on me, did I not? Yeah, I did. Oh, that's the wrong ones. Okay, one there. Oh, one there. One there, and... no, oh, it's all baked. Cool. So I gotta hammer all this stuff out. Oh, that's on the table. That comes off. Okay. So let me hammer these up, and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got the last of the nails going through right now. Did I not pick them all up? No, I guess not. I right, process this through pretty quick. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off, and apparently... The meat, meat can go bad, as I will show you in a second here. Oh, I do not want to pick that up. Put that back down, please. Uh, thank you. I just want to take out the nails. But, uh, yeah, the meat went green. It's not saying anything about the actual state of the meat, but I'm going to assume it's not safe to eat. Okay, so what was I building here? Oh, yeah, we were going to go ahead and make our tool, tool workstation. Which is all the way down here. I'm sorry, did I not pick up the nails? Oh, I did not. Oh, I thought when you took them out, it automatically picked them up. My bad. Okay. Now we can go down to here and to a workbench. Go ahead and place this. And we're going to place this up top because we're going to be moving up here anyways. Why not? And this way it gives me something to actually see when I'm going around. Okay, let's place that here. And what do I need? Nothing. I just need to hit. I have everything on me. So, yeah, it's uh, something to do about like modular tools like different parts you put together. So I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Oh. Okay. No idea what's going on here. How do I modify my tool? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I think I know what I gotta do here. I think I just gotta swap out the head. Get the stone one off, put the hatchet on there. 
which was not in here, and not in here either. And of course, it's chest number three. All right, let's run back up here and see if this actually works. So honestly, I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing here. Okay. This part is not compatible. Really? Well, then... Uh, okay, you're saying... Right click for more options. Oh. I guess I need to make a handle of some sort. Now, where would I make that? Because these are just sticks, right? I'm wondering if I need a straight stick for it. I'm wondering if I got one up here. I have no idea. I'm not going to run around. It's starting to get dark. Take one of these. I'll let the bird do its thing. I have no idea what it's doing. And let's see what we can do here. Okay. Actually, I have to have a tool in your hand. Interesting. All right, well, let's see here. Oh, hang on. Oh, no. Why is it saying building mode in here? You go in here, it's like, building mode and building mode brings you up into this which doesn't mean anything that's not what we're looking at here uh, let me look this up I'll be right back okay so I looked into it and apparently uh, I need to make a lathe which is down here you need the lathe to make candles now I'm making the gears right now uh, I do have to cast some more nails oh geez that's fine. Uh, where did I put my nuggets? Uh, fortunately, this doesn't take very long. So I'll go ahead and we'll get. See if we can do two nuggets at a time. Okay, and then we'll close that. Uh, get the old fire starter out. And. Oh, that's right. No, left click. We'll like that. Okay, I got that extra nail back. Okay, there is. Oh, I like that. A gear ends up on a table. Alright, so while that is doing that, I gotta go run upstairs, get two more planks crafted. I don't know what we're gonna need for the the handle. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a guess on two meter log or two meter or one meter logs. Actually that's what I wanna do. We'll go ahead and get two more of these going. Just because and then go deal with my inventory because it's an absolute mess and I won't be picking up all those planks and everything else I gotta pick up with. Uh, also, I'll look at possibly making another big, one of those bigger chests. Uh, let's see what I can get rid of. Put those nuggets away. I really don't need them right now. Uh, oh yeah, I was going to make a different axe too. Because uh, the hatchet, I don't think is really the best for trees. Because I was looking at like there's a whole bunch of different trees and uh, axes we can get here. The small hatchet. The damage on trees is actually quite low. So what I want to do is I believe it was the felling axe. It seems to have the highest damage on trees. So I need to get some more clay for that. So maybe what I'll do is I'll do that and uh, come back when I have the mold ready. Okay, I'm back and I am all done. I also picked up, uh, picked up enough clay to make three more casts. Oh, they break. Okay, well that's uh, good to know. Do I get the clay back? I do. It looks like you only get three back. Alright, that's fine. 
Uh, that's fine, at least we know. Uh, but yeah, I made a pickaxe, made a builder's hammer, and then I made a, a felling axe. So we have that. I have everything else made. I got the nails on me. I have the gears. All that stuff is the planks. And uh, well, maybe what we'll do is I know we can do this. Let's try to move this. Let's actually move it upstairs. Because that's where we're going to be working. Just because. Now I'm actually curious if you can actually... Oh, well, that's weird. Like a, little, like a trail coming off the, the ghost. Really is a ghost. Ooh, spooky. Alright, but, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, if you can move, like, a chest full of items. But anyways, so we are here. So we go to stations. We go down to... Of course, I'll be moving all this stuff later. Okay. You did not quite reach. Stations. Uh, where is that lathe? One plank short. What do you mean? Gotta make one more plank. That's probably why. Go to stations. All this for all this for an axe, huh? No, that's not what I want. I want the lathe. Okay. Uh, again, let's, uh, let's put it right next to here for now. Uh, I hope there's something that we can get to eventually where we can actually clear all this foliage out of the way. I need planks. Actually, let's just do it this way. Shift click. Fortunately, the building doesn't take too long in this. I like how things can get powered too. Now, as far as I know, we should be able to power this by hand. Uh, at least that's what I'm hoping. If not, we're going to be making a windmill. Okay, and that should be it. And the nails. Nail it all together. That's cool. Powered by gears. Oh, really? So you mean I have to get into like a windmill or something to actually get power? Uh, let's just have a look at that. Alright, okay, what are we going to need here? Let's go with a windmill. Uh, windmill. Okay, I can do that. And then the gears. Like I don't know how it's going to be placed. Looks like it's down below, so how much do the gears cost? Probably under craftables. No, it's here. Oh god. Oh god. I just just wanted a proper axe. Is that so hard to add? too much to ask? But I thought we could manually power this thing. Well, that's kind of a, a downer. But uh let me see how long we've been recording here. Okay, I'm back. Uh, it took me a while to find it. I was looking more or less looking for the wrong thing. It kind of blends in with other things. But I do have the bamboo. I also made a small cart and uh, kind of left it somewhere. It, it's a good idea. I didn't actually try to put anything in it. Uh, but it's kind of hard because you don't use mouse steering. You actually have to use A and D to steer around. So it was kind of awkward. You're looking one way, but you're moving the other way. And you, you have to look down to see which way. And the thing's actually facing. But I should have everything on me now to make a windmill as soon as I find it. Oh, I gotta cut the... Oh, I actually need more bamboo logs. Okay, that's fine. So then that means I gotta go and hunt down more bamboo. I should just drop all this on the ground here and hopefully they don't go flying anywhere because of the physics. Uh, no, I wanna cut those up if they would stop twitching. Come on. Wait, is my axe broken? No. No, they're just glitching out. Which is nothing new to me. Okay, there's that. And then 
come on. The swinging animation makes it a little difficult sometimes. Okay, I don't know why that's not working. Let's try this. Neat little rows. And go from there. So I need 12 short ones. This will give me 8. If it'll actually work. Guess I can't help. <laughs> Makes sense. You gotta crouch down to actually reach the stuff. Okay, now that gives me 12. Okay, and then I have one. So I gotta find a few more. So I should be easy to find now that I actually know what I'm looking for. So I'll do that and I shall return. Okay, I can uh, show you the trouble I'm having. So this is bamboo but it's not harvestable bamboo. It's not showing up as a hitbox. Uh, so you're you're looking for green stuff like this, but you don't st stop to think that maybe this brown decaying stuff is bamboo. And that's actually the bamboo. And that's why it throws me off, because it looks like regular bushes. So as you can see, there's tons of it, and uh, we're actually just over by the clay. So yeah, just gotta gr grab a couple of these. They actually cut down pretty quick. Uh, that actually answers my question. I was going to ask about uh, like how some tools work better on trees than on uh, plants, and if bamboo was could be considered a plant or a tree, and apparently it's a tree. All right, so that is that. Uh, let me run back home, and I'll meet you when we get there. Okay, I have absolutely everything I need now. All I have to do is make some more rope, and I got the rope made, so we can go ahead and make this windmill and see exactly what it does and how it works and what we got to do with this thing. I uh, guess I'll place the windmill first. And I'm just noticing this ghost and I'm wondering if it's me. So let me check my settings here quickly. No, apparently not. Uh, I thought it was, I had motion blur on, but that's not the case. Okay, uh, where is the hitbox of this thing? Tooltip. Okay, so we need more bamboo logs. Uh, we need the long ones, I think it said. Or short ones, I have no idea. We'll just keep hammering and grabbing supplies as we go along. Okay, then the ropes. It's actually looking pretty cool. Kind of wondering how we're going to get it connected, though, if nothing's on the actual grid. I'm going to find out pretty quick here. Okay, I need leaves and a log. Okay, leaves. And what did it say I needed? Oh, hold on. Light spike or game crash? I have a feeling it's game crash. I think so. I shall return. Okay, I'm back. It's been a while. I've actually had to do this. This is the third time I've had to do this because the save rolled back to just when we were building the, the tool workbench before we even found out about the lathe and all that stuff. Okay, that's not going to go in, so we'll just have to do that. Uh, as far as I can tell, I've been getting a memory leak, which is what's been causing me to lock up like it did. But it hasn't been really focused on anything it was always as soon as I got to a certain stage in the windmill it was acting up and I thought maybe that uh, that had something to do with it but that wasn't the case it's funny how you can fix an axe or fix a hammer on a grindstone uh, yeah so needless to say this is the third time I've done this but I did them in a different order this time maybe that'll do things a little differently as you can see I got the windmill all set up and it is doing its thing I don't know if you can hear that, but it's actually making sound, which is kind of weird because there's nothing here that would actually make sound except for maybe the gears. But anyways, I fixed my axe. Maybe this will. Or I fixed my hammer. Maybe this will get uh, built a little bit better. And I think we might have to get some sort of.
connector built for the gears. Okay, so now what do we actually do with this? I don't think I can make them in here, can I? Oh yeah, right here, uh, no. All right, well, let's go to the workbench and see what we have. I swear to God, this grass is growing taller and taller. Okay, we need... Would it be under tools? Stations? Yes. Uh, let's see here. I guess I'll try that. I do have some bamboo somewhere. I'm just gonna make two wooden gears and get some sticks. So let me get this together and I'll throw it. We'll check it out. Okay, I have everything now. So we go down. We go down and grab the horizontal connector and we'll see exactly how this thing works. Uh, well, it would work if I didn't have a pigeon in the way. Oh, I guess we have to put the lathe on this side then. So it looks like everything snaps in. Interesting. And I get this funny feeling I should be saving right now. Oh yeah, I forgot to grab the bamboo. I cut it, but I never picked it up. just be able to move it and look at that it snaps right into place but it doesn't want to go there oh my god well hello mr. pigeon one hit owl didn't look like no owl to me God, I can actually eat it the way it is. That's sad. Okay. Move that over there. Get out of here. So the only thing is you have to actually go into here to actually get that. And... Oh, look at that. I have a lathe. Cool. How do you make something like that on a lathe? Basic handle. Let's see. Basic handle. Okay, this is all test stuff. There's the shovel handle, ha handle, the straight handle, which is not straight. Basic ha hammer handle and a handle handle. Okay, log blocks. All right, uh, let me get a few blocks and I'll be back. Okay, well, I got everything ready. I also went ahead and made uh, a couple of iron tool heads. You got a pickaxe, builder's hammer, and a felling axe. Now, oh, I thought, I thought that was a bore. Now, unfortunately, my bed is broken. Now, I can't actually repair that thing. I can't, for some reason, build another one. So, uh, I'm out of luck. I can't build a bed until I get into cloth, which means a loom, and God knows what else we're going to need for that. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and make... Uh, nothing, because I forgot to grab the blocks. Fortunately, they're right here. I'll grab three of these. And I think what I'm going to do... Is only you build a standard ham ha handle for the hammer. Actually, what is my inventory space? Terrible. Uh, we'll just leave him there. Why not? And put the sticks there too. And oh, the bamboo. Sure, it's actually quite plentiful now that I know what to look for. All right, so this is going to be for the axe. Craft that, and it's already in my inventory. Craft one of these for the hammer, and axe hammer, and oh yeah, pickaxe. I think we're not going for a shovel. I wonder what would be good for a pickaxe. Good for cutting plants. 
It's nice he's got little, uh, little descriptions on each. Let's go with the base cattle. Okay, so now, what do we do here? Let's try it. Let's try it this way here. Okay, no, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing here. Okay, and that's gonna be the builder's hammer. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay. Yeah, no idea what I'm supposed to do here. And building mode does that. Hmm. Let me see if I can figure something out here. Okay, I think I'm on to something, but it's going on in an odd place. Well, this is the builder's handle. I got the builder's hammer. Oh, there we go. That's cool. Okay, so I'll go here. And then do the same thing. And will this go on here? No. So, neither one of these will actually go on here. Which means I have to build make more, more axes, or handles. I'm going to say that would be for... I was actually like pickaxe handles. Let me make them and see if I can make them up. Okay, I have it and done. So now we can go ahead and this is actually the right handle. So we'll go in here and it's, uh, let's actually get a little further on the bench so we can actually see what we're doing here. And uh, oh, I can't actually move the mouse or the screen. But anyways, take a long curved handle. And on this one, we can place an axe, axe head. And then we take another one. And uh, we gotta hit E to modify. And there's our pickaxe head. It actually gives you like stats. That's really cool. Anyway, uh, before we end this, let's uh, take our new axe for a test drive. Let's see how well it works. Um, let's go over here and cut down some more palm trees because I'm thirsty. Me as well. Oh wow, that's like twice as fast. Loving it. It's the little things in life that make you make you happy, isn't it? All right, so I got a new axe, I got a, a new pickaxe, and a new hammer, and we're good to go. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, that's cool. I'm going to show you like the different actual parts. That's really cool. That's interesting. That makes me wonder how many different types of uh, castings you can make, like different types of metal and stuff like that. But anyways, I think what I'm going to do between this episode and the next episode is I'm going to try to clear some stuff down. Uh, I am a little worried that things grow back. Like I know these plants keep growing back, but we'll see how it goes. Maybe I'll take some small things out and then we'll get ourselves a little house set up. And we'll start progressing into other stuff. Another one I'd like to do too is uh, I want to... I thought you could upgrade this thing. I thought, or is there an actual like a tier 2 work workbench? Uh, I could have sworn that you could upgrade this thing and you need steel for it. Unless there's something I'm missing. There used to be an upgrade button here. Yeah. But anyways, we'll figure that out the next time. Anyways, I thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. As always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.